Hey guys, Silence Yao here. Welcome back to another episode of Utah Across Gacha video. So today, we finally have Kaname coming into the game with her version of the um, ice skating costume. And yes, if you guys have actually logged in today after the server refreshed at um, 12 noon in Japan, and if you happen to go into the live tab, you will probably see this notification saying that um, Isorado is now a permanent song in the Macross Frontier line of songs within Uta Macross itself. So don't forget to go and play the game, or rather play the song <coughs> with this song and attain all the free singing stones that you can get, you know, with each difficulty. And that is if you actually full combo each of the difficulties because you know, free to play players, you gotta dig wherever you can for all the free currency because you just need to you know pull all the brand new gachas yeah? so don't forget to do that um after the event ends today which is within another 50 minutes from the time i'm recording this video <laughs> hopefully you guys are doing well for the event itself uh don't forget you still have the current event that's going on um, for the the culture mixture songs, which is um, Ikenai Borderline, sung by Ranka and Shero. Hopefully, you've been alternating between Shero and Ranka each day because that's apparently what I predicted, and apparently that's how it ended up. <laughs> and that's why I didn't make any update notifications or video regarding brand new missions um, for the current part one of the culture mixtures. Um, so yeah, anyways, let's dive into the gacha page and let's talk about the main stuff for today. Alright, so let's take a look at Kaname's brand new episode play. So it comes in at 3,861 total score. Of course, Soul gets the highest amount of points. Voice coming in second place and Charm takes the biggest dive down the gutter. Um, pay attention to who can use the episode play as well. So Mikumo, Rei Rei and Minmei fans, uh, you definitely want to pay attention to this episode play if it ends up being useful. Alright, center skill. It seems like all the recent episode plays have been getting very nice center skill percentages. So this unit's um, soul will be boosted by 90% up, which is fantastic. Very nice number, but sadly to say like as always, if you've got 7 star episode plates, usually you would not use a 6 star episode plate as a center position episode plate. Makes no sense. Anyway, active skill, it has that modern active skill. For 5 seconds, your score is boosted by 70% up. Which is meh. <laughs> We've seen older episode plates that has the better skill, which is 10 seconds for 100% boost in score. But of course, older episode play, it means, you know, the total score generically should be lower than the current episode plates. But, you know, sometimes the older ones are more powerful than the newer ones in some way or other. Anyways, life skill. So short duration. Okay, so this one comes with a not so useful life skill because it relies on the fold percentage um, so that's kind of a bummer so I mean if you've got episode plates like this already in your collection you might consider not wanting to pull this episode plate unless you are a Kanami fan of course then you have to pull for your waifu um, but other than that I don't see a reason for attaining this episode plate technically um, the episode plate Oh, I forgot to mention it. Without its plus twenty-five luck value, it comes in at three thousand six hundred and eleven total score, which is actually seven points higher than Freya's recent episode plate. So that's pretty interesting. Um, but still, it doesn't top old school episode plates that has come in with like three thousand seven hundred total score at a six star rarity. So, yeah consider that. Anyways, let's take a look at the last page and mm, it seems like Dana is tossing in a lot more episode plates with the fold note nowadays. So there aren't exactly a lot of episode plates with the fold notes or even the attack notes like I mentioned in the last video. Um, these are not exactly very needed in the gameplay but you know like sometimes they do toss up events where the boss fights in the Valkyrie attack phase can get a bit tough so episode plates like these do come in handy once in a while you know once in a blue moon but you know it'll be nice to attain at least 
a, you know, a backup copy or something to stand by. So, Kaname fans, is this episode play important for you? Yes, of course, it's your waifu. Why not get one? Um, for the rest of us who are not Kaname fans, it is still pretty decent of an episode play. Um, it has a pretty decent total score. It comes with a special note attached to it. Although the live skill is kind of disappointing, but, you know, like I said, it is kind of a backup episode plate. So if you don't have anything with full notes, I would highly recommend you to try and attain this episode plate. But you know, there's there's really no pressure to trying to attain it. It you can come to you casually in the future through maybe guaranteed five star episode plates or even your super dimension gacha pools, or even you know featured episode plate gachas that. Re have reruns of these episode plates in the future, so no rush technically. All right, with all of that said, hopefully it is um, it eases your wallet in some way. Um, let's do the usual stuff. Let's do the free daily pool. I'm doing this in the evening because I'm recording this after work. I am actually very tired. <laughs> Haven't been getting enough sleep um, ever since I did this full time job. Um, it's really taxing on the the body physically. A lot of physical work. Oh, yeah. All right, let's skip this because it's not gonna be anything fantastic. It is in the double-digit quantities, but it's still the low counts, so that's it's fine. It means today's luck is pretty really mediocre. So yeah. Anyways, I have some tickets that expiring today. Um, so let's pull ten plates from the Super Dimension Gacha. Let's see what we get. Hmm. Oh, loading bar. Interesting. Okay, here we go. Even if we get something nice from this, I think that's fine. Oh, no Valkyries at all. Wow. That's kind of disappointing. Okay, no red boxes. Oh, wow. There was a load bar though, but there's no <laughs> red boxes at all. <clears throat> Excuse me. Hmm. Maybe a silver box might evolve. Who knows? Alright, let's skip all the common stuff. <clears throat> Something's in my throat. Okay, so really nothing good at all. Oh boy, that's not a good sign. Hopefully the main gacha banner doesn't end up being this horrible. <laughs> okay, let's see. We still have the free pool from the feature banner, so let's do that first. No load bar at all from this. So I'm just looking at the bare minimum, which is costume points for Kaname's brand new costume. So yeah, um, speaking of costume points, I apparently I managed to pull out uh, Makina's Valentine's Day costume points um, from free pools recently. <laughs> So yeah, it gave me a chance to unlock Makina's costume, so that's pretty sweet. So yeah, even though if you don't, uh, or rather you missed out the chance or aren't able to pull the brand new gacha banners that you really want to, you know, don't forget, sometimes, you know, wonderful stuff like this can actually happen, you know, with reissuing stuff. So yeah, so we're going for the template discounted pool, we get a bit of a load bar there as well, but still, huh. Today's luck doesn't seem that fantastic. Three Valkyries. Yeah, pretty mediocre as expected. Red box on a single bling. Two red boxes. So, like I said, I just need costume points. Ooh, red box so early. Okay, is Freya pointing towards a brighter future? I don't know. Give me costume points, please. Uh oh. Where are my costume points? This is not looking good. <laughs> Last red box. No costume points at all. Okay, so today's luck is really horrendous. Guys, that's it for today. Like I said, uh, I've already spent too much on trying to gain Ray Ray's 7 star episode plate. It's nice that this month at least we managed to pull up um, Makina 6 star episode plate, so that's pretty fantastic. It's been a while since we pulled anything that rare. Um, but yeah, today, today is really a big flop, so hopefully you guys don't end up as horrible as the luck as mine. 
uh, especially for those of you who are Kaname fans, I know there are a few of you who are watching my videos who are big Kaname fans, so hopefully you manage to pull out your waifu's episode plate, or at least are able to unlock her costume with episode thoughts, um, even if you don't get her episode plate, you know, at least, you know, we can try to gain the full set of these uh, ice skating costumes. Uh, kind of, well, technically with Makina and Reina's behind 7 star episode place, it's gonna be a very difficult collection. But still, not as horrible as the um, Mirai on cheerleading costume set, which is entirely 7 stars except for one person, I think. Who knows, I can't remember, my mind is a bit blank right now. I'm very tired, I'm gonna go rest for a bit. Anyway guys, until then, I'll see you guys soon. Bye! Oh wait, I forgot to mention. Thank you guys so much for all the views on the recent um, special sequence for EK9 Borderline by Cheryl and Ranka. Um, it's been a while since I've seen any video of mine actually gone above 1000 views. Uh, even though technically the, the videos of that kind with music, um, it's not able to monetize in the future. But it does help with the view count, and uh, I've noticed that a lot of you, a lot more of you have actually subscribed, even though it's not a, a big jump, but still, more subscribers. So yeah, we're moving towards you know the 1K subscriber count, and hopefully, eventually, to monetize this YouTube channel, and maybe I might be able to shift into a full-time YouTuber thing in the future. Who knows? Thank you guys so much again. Really, really, thank you guys so much for all the views you know and the promotions maybe you guys have been sharing the the video to other people as well you know it really helped me out a lot so big hugs big loves from you know this big giant teddy bear here <laughs> until then guys i'll see you guys soon again bye